my amazing YouTube family. Thank you all for stopping by. Today I'm going to show you how to make these delicious stuffed plantains. So here I have three ripe plantains and I'll be using some salted fish, some spinach, pumpkin, I have minced garlic, diced onions, diced bell peppers, some gouda cheese, chicken bouillon, black pepper and some complete seasoning. So the first thing you want to do is fry your plantains. Now if you want to boil your plantains instead, you sure can. I just wanted that nice golden brown color on my plantains, so that's why I'm frying it. I'm frying on medium low heat and once they're brown on one side, you want to flip them over and just keep rotating them so that they'll become brown on all sides. Once your plantains are fully cooked, you can remove them and allow them to drain while we proceed with the next step. To the same skillets, I did remove some of the oil and now we'll go in with our aromatics. We'll add our onions, garlic and the bell peppers. Give it a good mix and allow it to go for about 3 minutes. Next, we'll add our pumpkin since it takes the longest to cook and we'll allow it to go for about three to five minutes. Now we'll add our spinach as well as our seasonings to add flavor and taste to the dish. Give it a good toss, allow it to go for about a minute or two, and then we'll go in with our salted fish. Once the salt fish is added, give it a good toss and allow that to go for about a minute or two as well. Lastly, we'll add a little bit of cheese. I know some may ask why add cheese because it seems like a weird combination when cooking salt fish. But trust me on this, the cheese doesn't have a harsh taste. It's not cheddar cheese. So it ties everything together. That's the purpose of it. Now moving on to the plantains. I already did one of them, but this is what I did. Just cut straight down the middle. And you want to be very gentle when you're pricing it open because we want it to remain intact. And this can easily break apart. So you want to be very gentle and just make a pocket right down the middle. And this is where we will place our filling. Next, you want to grab a generous amount of your filling and just place it inside of the plantains. You can put as much or as little as you like, but I don't like to overfill mine simply because it just keeps falling out and, you know, we don't want that. We want everything to remain intact. So we will fill them up, all three, and then I'll show you all the next step. The last and final step, you want to just add a little bit of that cheese right over top. Now again, the cheese is used to tie everything together just to prevent the filling from falling out. So we'll place this in a 400 degree oven for about 5 minutes. And that's it guys, it's that simple and easy to make this and it's perfect for breakfast, brunch or even dinner. And here you have it, stuffed plantains, Caribbean style. You know we love our salt, fish, pumpkin, and our callaloo. So this is a perfect bite. It was the perfect amount of sweetness mixed with the saltiness. And let me tell you, I was so mad I didn't make more because it was amazing. I hope you all give this recipe a try. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up, share it, and leave a comment down below. I will leave all the ingredients and measurements down in my description box, and I'll see you all next time. Thank you for watching. I appreciate your support, and as always, enjoy!